What is up, people? Mr. Valley here bringing you another video. We are here for Sunny Villa, our first level. Here we go. Technically, I had 400, but I had to free Sheila. And sadly, there is no cutscene at the start. Which kind of sucks. Oh my, oh my, can you help us? Hordes of ferocious Rhinox have overrun our town and kidnapped the mayor. Are you a dragon? I can't believe your kind really exists. I am. Oh. <laughs> Just let me catch my breath. And then I'll kick that other guy's butt. Which he won't. We showed those two bullies. If they hadn't outnumbered me two to one, I'd have finished them off ages ago. <laughs> Would you now? Very pretty. By the way, if you're wondering why I'm flaming the trees, that's a skill point. I remember that from the first game. Do these things interact with you? Yeah, they ribbit at you. <laughs> I don't know why the frog has a tooth though. It's a little funny. Where were you going? This Rhinoc is too big to charge. You'll have to flame him using the attack button. Yeah, I already knew that, Zoe. You told me before. And yes, there are no more spirit particles. Now you get the gems again from killing an enemy. Okay, I don't think I missed gems, but I could have. Wow, he can reach me from there. Vanessa! <laughs> the tree still smokes afterwards. That's a, that's pretty cool. I like the added touch. The permanently flaming tree. That actually looks really cool looking. Hold on. Wait, wait. That's cool. Wait a minute. Where are you, frog? I'm sorry. Oh, damn it. 
Spyro, thanks for dropping by, but I'm currently busy in my home world. Come visit me there, Sheila. I forgot you got to actually beat Sheila's world first before it's unlocked. <sighs> so there will... So I will finish that in Sheila's level video. We will come back here in the same video as Sheila's level and do both at the same time. So stay tuned for episode three because it'll be the very next episode from this one. Miles. Morales. That's probably his last name is Morales. And here's a gem I somehow missed. Hi Spyro. Each time a fairy zaps you, like this. It means your progress has been saved. If you get into trouble, you'll return to the last place you got zapped. Okay, thank you. Giant chicken. Oh. He killed it. Whoa, I'm easy. He keeps running in a circle. Because that guy was chasing him. for the hell, but I think I could have worn him down sooner or later. You're welcome. Thank you for rescuing our town. As mayor, I awarded you with one of our famous giant chicken eggs. <laughs> I'm sorry. That was the ugliest chicken I've ever seen. <laughs> and he goes through the portal. There's the skill point. Hey Spyro, I found this gladiator training arena that also makes for a pretty cool skate park. Care for a test of your boarding skills? No. Yeah, maybe you better practice a bit first. Just come back here when you're up for a challenge. Okay, I'm ready. Are you ready for Yeah, I'm gonna try it. You can't catch all 15 lizards running around here. Just come back if you want some boarding tips from the master. <laughs> Ooh, that's a little difficult. And the next egg is to do this without falling off your board. The controls are a little bit weird. Very specific in the turning. I wish there was a sensitivity thing though. 
so that um, if you're more used to how uh, this original Spyro uh, 3 controls were with skateboarding and stuff, then you can change the sensitivity. Okay, let's try this. Up in the air. Up in the air. Get you. I am so glad that didn't make me fall. Where are you both going? Get back here. Gotcha. Where's the last lizard? I don't even know. Unless I just passed him. Was that him? Oh no, I see the balloon. I forgot I gotta go up. Back up. That was great! And while you were boarding, I found this in a lizard burrow. Emily! <laughs> cool. Alright, if you can catch all the lizards before time expires without wiping out, I might be able to scrounge up another egg. It's not gonna be easy though. Yes. Get him, Spyro. I will try. It's a little difficult to get the landings in some of them, but I'm going to try. The time part isn't the problem. It's the not wiping out part that's the problem. Really? Really? There we go. At least hitting the lizards doesn't actually count as wipe, or doesn't make you wipe out. I'm also glad that they changed um, the jumping and the skateboarding because that that I did forget. I did see that because that was um, I complained about thing. Um, that they changed how jumping... Ooh, damn it! They complained how jumping what worked um, with the skateboarding, and they said that you would jump over the lizard. Um, instead of how in the original, you don't jump over the lizard, you just um, do what it just did this time. Or, now what they changed it to. Neighbor is shooting a gun. That's great. At what? I don't know. As you can see, yeah, time is not the problem. It's just wiping out that's the problem. you and got you now the last ones are right up here with plenty of time to spare again it's just the wiping out issue and really they go back that's not how it was in the original it's okay I got it Whoa, that was sweet! And look, there was another egg in the lizard burrow. Oh, look at that. Daisy! <laughs> you can go for the course record now if you want. Whenever you hop on a skateboard, a timer will start. Score as many points as you can until the timer expires or you wipe out. Good luck! I'll try it because that's a skill point, I'm pretty sure. Ooh, I almost messed up. Let's 
Let's see, gulp and crush. Yeah, see? You see how I landed? And I have no idea where I was. <sighs> really? Why did they do that? Okay. Now, how did they change roles? Ooh, I messed up again. Where's the skateboard? There it is. Because there's supposed to be a way to do a roll, but I don't know. That's not it. Hmm. Okay, but where is skateboarding? I can't. I don't see it. They didn't add a skateboarding thing. Stunts or oh, triangle? That's what it was. That's what I gotta do is triangle. And I'm pretty sure I did not get any course record in this one. Jump. Wow, really? I thought that would have landed. Yep. 3,200. Wow, I actually was so close to the course record. Look at how how precise that is. Oh my god, that's so annoying. Okay, there's the first one. There's the second one. All I need is a front flip, and that's pretty much it, or a back flip, and actually land it, there we go. I'm glad it's okay to wipe out. Okay. And then do each roll, and I should be fine. Ooh, there we go. Look at that. That one was nice. And that was called the Dr. Shemp. The Toasty Twist. Now look at all the points that I have. See, I just had to get used to it, but damn, is that very specific. Very precise on what um, you gotta be able to do. That should have been extra points like for doing a front flip and a back flip at the same time. Let's try to get some gems. New course record. Skill point acquired. Okay. And Sparks does not have the gem finder ability in this. Because you need to unlock it in the third one. Which kind of sucks, to be honest, but you know. See, that should have wiped me out, and that one actually didn't. Do you see how weird that is? Okay. 
Okay, I'm pretty sure there's gems up there. But I don't know if I got them all. I, I probably already... Yeah, I got them. If there were any. I don't even know if there were. To be honest. Um, I don't see any more gems. Hopefully we got them all. Okay, we got both skill points and everything that we could in, except for the Sheila level, so. As far as I know, because... Oh, wait a minute. Sparks is looking for gems. But it... Interesting. They actually allowed us to have the ability from the start instead of unlocking it. So what is that unlock then? When... when we do the sparks level that did unlock it. What? This way now? Okay, so he's saying to go up where Sheila is, but is he saying to go in the portal? Or is he just saying, I missed something up there? find out. I should have done that in the skateboarding part then. Oh, he actually tells you to go in the portal. Wait, up. What do you mean up? Oh, yeah, yeah. He tells you to go in the portal. That is pretty cool. That is smart. I like that. So if he tells you to go in Sheila's portal, does that mean... What the heck? Look, a chicken turned up. I hope it's not the only one left. Look. Um, I don't remember that being in the original, so that is pretty cool. And I'm glad that I can't kill it. Honestly, I'm glad I can't kill it. That's cool that they added that. I love it. I'm just gonna make sure. Yeah, see how he he's not telling me to go in this portal, but I'm just gonna just in case. Okay, so he does tell you if there's gems in the portal. Cool. I really like that. Now we're done. Until Sheila. Yeah, I remember ending at 4.11 in the original playthrough, too, so that is correct. Okay, next episode, everyone. Sheila's Alp. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.